Hello everyone. Hope you all are doing well. In this video, we will be learning about the topic components of food, which is the second topic of class sixth science. Children, you know that we eat different types of food for our breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Do you think our body needs all these different kinds of food? Yes, our body requires food that has different components in it. That is, the components from both plants as well as animals. These components of food are called as nutrients. The major nutrients in our food are carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins, and minerals. In addition, food contains dietary fibers. and water which are also needed by our body do you think every food item contains all these nutrients in order to know this let us perform some test starting with test for carbohydrates there are many types of carbohydrates the main carbohydrates found in our food are in the form of starch and sugars take iodine solution a slice of bread rice biscuits and a slice potato put two to three drops of iodine solution on each of the eatables you will observe that a blue black color appears on all the food items which indicates the presence of starch Test for proteins. Take egg white, milk, salt water, copper sulfate solution, caustic soda, and three test tubes. Fill the first test tube with some milk. Second test tube with salt water. and the last test tube with egg white add two drops of solution of copper sulfate and almost 10 drops of solution of caustic soda in all the test tubes and shake well the first test tube with milk turns light violet in color the second test tube with salt water turns blue in color and the third test tube with egg white turns dark violet in color the violet color indicates the presence of proteins since the egg white is a very rich source of proteins it turns dark violet in color that is why to be healthy you need to have a glass of milk and a boiled egg every day test for fats Take a plain white sheet of paper. Next, take some ground nuts and then de-skin them. Next, crush these ground nuts and spread them on a white paper and keep it aside for an hour. You will observe oily patches on the paper. The oily patch on the paper shows that ground nut contains fat. Now let us take a quick look at the summary points. A body requires food that has different components in it. Major nutrients in our food are carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins and minerals. Milk and egg are rich sources of proteins. Ground nuts are a good source of healthy fats. Thank you. Keep watching. Please like subscribe and press the bell icon to get notifications of the upcoming videos